Newcastle co-owner Amanda Staveley has given assurances to fans that its unlikely majority shareholders, PIF, would dump the club and buy Manchester United or Liverpool instead. English football's two most successful clubs are both up for sale or at least open to major investment. But speaking at the Financial Times Football Summit, Staveley said the Saudis chose Newcastle because they were a far cheaper option and she can't see that changing. We did go for a... Uh, you know, uh, the wonderful Tottenham and, and Chelsea and, and, and Liverpool. And obviously, everybody knows I was a massive Liverpool fan. We tried to buy Liverpool uh, and we walked, we walked into, you know, when we walked into a Newcastle game, we said, why spend X billion when you can actually spend 300 and some million and, and you know, we'll, and put in, I think we've put in 200 plus to date um, of new money since we bought the club. So we had a particular business plan based on a 5, 10, 15 year timeline. Um, critical to that plan was making sure we had the right partners. So making sure PIF, who are very long term investors. No Manchester United, no. No, I don't think so. That's not my, I can't speak for PIF or, um, and certainly I can't, but that just, I, I really wouldn't have. I mean, we've built that, you know, in the last year, it's extraordinary. We've 11th, we're hoping potentially there might be the chance of Champions League. Um, I love the valuations that are reflected in Chelsea because it, looks, it makes our valuation look very compelling. We bought the club at under two times um, revenue. You know, when you're looking at five to seven times revenue, that is a lot of money.